Republican Senator John Kenney out of Louisiana, member of the Senate Judiciary Committee. How are you doing, sir? I know you've got a lot to say about this. Let me show you what the National Education Association statement says on that. By the way, 3.2 million union members strong. Publicly, through existing media, convey its support for the accurate and honest teachings of social studies topics, including truthful and age-appropriate accountings of unpleasant aspects of American city. In teaching, uh, history rather, in teaching these topics, it's reasonable and appropriate for curriculum to be informed by academic frameworks for understanding and interpreting the impact of the past on current society, including critical race theory. Here's the deal. The union wants it. But even the far left progressives thought this is too much, it's too complicated, we'll save it for special classes or special courses for older uh, students. But the union wants it from the kindergarten to the 12th grade. How's that going to go? Critical race theory is a uh, fairy tale promoted by many, not all, but many of my Democratic colleagues, uh, including the Biden White House. Critical race the theory teaches that America is totally screwed. We need to just tear it down and start over. Critical race theory teaches that the primary reason that America was founded was to maintain white supremacy. Not freedom, not rule of law, not equal opportunity, not personal responsibility, but white supremacy. Critical race theory also teaches that um, non uh, uh, black Americans are racist, that they, they don't much like black people, whether those non-black Americans realize it or not. That's why critical race theory also teaches that white children are born bad. It teaches that black children are born trapped. There's almost no hope for them. It's a very fatalistic point of view. In my judgment, Critical race theory is cynical, ahistorical, uh, sophomoric, insipid, and dumb as a bag of hair. Um, America is not a racist country. We have racists in it, just like everywhere else. But most Americans, black and white, think a whole lot more about character than they do about race. They believe in equality. And most Americans understand that uh, to a bear, we all taste like chicken. <laughs> I'll take your word for it. Uh, two dozen states have banned it. I would assume there would be a challenge at some point in those states. Can they win their case and keep it out? Yes. Um, the history of America is the best evidence that it's not racist. In 150 years, which is the blink of an eye in historical terms. We have gone from institutionalized slavery to the election of a black president who was also reelected. Um, we passed civil rights laws in 1866, uh, 1871, 1875, 1960, 1964, 1968, 1990, 1991, and I'm probably leaving some out. We have over 10,000 elected public officials in America today who happen to be black. Uh, pollsters don't even poll it anymore, but when they do, they find that over 90% over, uh, of Americans support interracial marriage. Uh, America is not perfect, but we are good. We caught the disease of slavery, but we beat it back. And it's something we work on every day. But I, I don't support, as does the Biden White House, just tearing this country down and starting over. Well, we'll see what the president has to say about it. As far as I know, he hasn't been asked point blank about it. Do you? Uh, I, I don't know. And, but, and I'm sure he'll be coached to dodge and bob and weave and stall and restall. But uh, I think all of this is coming from the, uh, the Biden White House. And its purpose is to set us up for a massive reparations appropriation. You think this is coming from the White House? I do. Well, Dr. Jill Biden was a teacher, still has the credentials to do it. You, th you think the Bidens are pushing this? Yes. Look, I have, um, I, 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 I'm in the Senate. I've listened to the testimony 
of the nominees by President Biden. Uh, the, 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 these folks are radical. They all believe in critical race theory. Uh, ask Attorney General Garland. I asked him if he thought the Department of Justice during his committee testimony was inherently racist. He, he wouldn't answer. That was my answer. Wow. Senator, thank you. Come back again. By the way, I misspoke. The NEA, the teachers union, represents 2 million members, but there are 3.2 million public school teachers in the U.S. Department of Education. We'll get that right. Thank you, but Senator. But they take their orders. They, uh, no, I, they take their orders from the yeah, Biden White yeah, House. I just didn't want to sell it higher than it actually is. Senator, thank you. We'll talk again.